Question 10. Describe fully the transformation that maps triangle P onto triangle Q. Well, if we look at this shape, it's not been rotated, it's not been reflected or enlarged, but it has moved. And that transformation is known as translation. So you'll get one of your marks just for using the correct word, which is translate. You could say translated, translation. It doesn't matter which form of the word you use as long as it describes that the shape has been translated. Now, translation is a description of how far something is moved, and this is usually written as a vector. Column vector is shown between two rectangular brackets, with a number at the top being how far it has moved on the x axis and the second number being on the y axis. It's not the distance between the two shapes, it's how far an individual point has moved. So if we look at this top right hand corner, we can see that it's gone 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 squares to the right, and 1 square down. So to go down the y-axis means we've got a translation of negative 1. That will give us our second mark.